had two projects that were awarded tonight. The first is the largest solar farm in Southeast Asia, 250 megawatts in Concepcion, Tarlac. That is also the first solar farm in the Philippines that is not going to avail of a feed-in tariff subsidy and still turn a profit. We believe that this is important because it shows the rest of Southeast Asia that there is a future for solar post feed and tariff. Secondly, is our project in a small town on an island south of Manila that has been without power for the last generation and that we are now going to power with 24-hour solar energy using batteries from Tesla. This is the largest island solar battery microgrid in the entire world and is hopefully going to be a prototype for not just the Philippines, and not just archipelagos, but all off-grid areas in Southeast Asia to show that without a single US dollar of government subsidy and at a lower cost to consumers than diesel, all off-grid and underserved areas can shift to renewable energy. The first one is the first to make use of made in the Philippines solar panels from our newly opened solar panel factory. And also a complete vertically integrated model of us constructing and developing that same project, which allows us to offer a rate that is less than half of what the previous lowest solar tariff was in the Philippines. And the second is the first to use megawatt scale batteries. I understand in the entire Asia Pacific region there isn't yet a solar battery microgrid of this scale and we've encountered a lot of learnings in implementing these projects and hopefully as the technology improves the economics will be even more compelling. That will be the awarded 250 megawatt solar farm in Concepcion Tarlac, which earlier in the year was actually planned to be 150 megawatts, but we're now expanding it with an additional 100 because we fully sold out its capacity at a record low 5.8 US dollar cents per kilowatt hour. It's a great opportunity to learn about what's happening in other markets and learn from the best practices and the best stakeholders in the industry and we look forward to coming again in subsequent years.